The final of Cron's Kitchen saw Heat winner Leon Barwell from Northampton Saints compete against Northampton's cricket legend Alan Lamb. Radio star Helen Blaby was on hand as compare for the evening with head chef Liam Goodwill keeping control of the kitchen. Before the cooking got underway, there was a special message from one of the UK's best known chefs. I'd like to wish both contestants competing at the Alboro restaurant the best of luck. I think you're going to need it. Now this event, organised by the Chronicle and Echo, has already raised a fantastic amount of money for the Macmillan Trust New Cancer Treatment Unit at Northampton General Hospital. And I'd like you all to dig really deep to raise more money for this incredibly important cause. Now Chef Liam Goodwill is going to be on hand to make sure that the contestants don't fight, don't stab each other, don't try and burn each other's souffles, and most importantly of all, stay safe. Although with Lammy in the kitchen, I'm not sure if that's going to be the easiest thing to do because the last time he did anything on national TV when it comes to cooking was when he blew up the food processor on Ready Steady Cook because he left the spoon in it. So you're all going to need the best of luck. One skate, three duck, two panna cotta, two move. Keeping with the previous heats, each chef was armed with an assistant and joined by a member of staff from Albero. Alan Lamb was joined by his wife Lindsay, while Leon brought Nick Beale. Each team had to cook four courses from a set menu, which included a chicken liver and foie parfait and crab risotto starter, followed by chilled pea and mint velou. The main course saw teams cook either roast duck breast with butternut squash and broad beans, or crisp skate, leeks, herb gnocchi and cockland shrimp brown butter. Live footage from the kitchen was broadcast on television screens in the restaurant so diners could watch both the teams preparing their meals. The event, organised by the Cron, was raising money for Macmillan Cancer Support for a new cancer unit at Northampton General Hospital. Dessert was vanilla panna cotta with poached pear and raspberry sorbet or dark chocolate mousse with creme fraiche, olive oil, sea salt and oats. After much deliberation by the judges, the result was announced as a draw. Both chefs then competed in an omelette challenge which was judged by Alvaro's head chef. It was Leon from the Saints team which walked away victorious. Uh, the whole day has been extremely challenging and uh, what it makes you realise is just how talented the guys that work here really are, you know. It's bloody hard work, they know their stuff, you know, just knowing the ingredients, knowing what temperatures things cook at, you know, it really is a skill and uh, it's been a real eye-opener, we've really enjoyed it. What they do here in the kitchen is incredible and it's so fantastic to have a a restaurant of this quality in Northampton, yeah, which is yeah, unbelievable, yeah. really unbelievable. Yeah. And I want to... <laughs> I just want to give a big hand to the chefs here, Liam and his team, Andy. Oh, yeah.